it just got interesting. What's up, Blue Game Babies? It is Belinda Torres, Third Eye Terror, to book a private reading. Use that website link in the bio. I just heard <clears throat> it's a showdown. It's a showdown. There's an angel and there's a devil. They're on a battlefield and they're about to duke it out. Except this is the divine feminine and the karmic female about to go at each other in a spiritual war. For some of you, this will be a physical war where some of you will physically get into altercations with these women because they will approach you. Spirit, talk to me about this down low. It's a showdown. The chariot. And boy, is it coming in quick. Somebody's got their eyes set on you. You need to be strategic when you battle this person. I just heard it's time to attack. With the Six of Wands, I feel like you will get the victory here. The Six of Pentacles balance being brought to this situation. The Knight of Cups. Literally, it's a showdown. The Five of Wands, a physical altercation. Put she psychic in the motherfucking comments. That's what this whole reading is about. There is a battle that is about to take place. The Knight of Cups, the Star, and the Eight of Pentacles. I feel like... As you're going through this spiritual warfare with this karmic, as you're fighting for your soul, your spirit, your sanity, your life, your career is taking off. You are the star. There's somebody coming in to bring you an offer here that's going to make you emotional. This could be an offer pertaining to your work that's going to make you very happy. And these could be happy tears emotion-wise, but you are the star and she hates it. She can't fucking stand that you the goat, baby. You the greatest all time. You the greatest ever did it, baby. Best it ever was. And it chaps her butt cheeks. The world. But you put an end to that. You said, mm-mm. I thought, motherfucker, time to stop. The book stops here, baby. Ending those cycles. Sailing you and someone else onto calmer waters here. Away from this. With the Two of Wands and the Nine of Pentacles. You're making plans to go spend your coin, to go travel, to live life. You're single and independent. This person is codependent. Cannot make it without a masculine. Always has to lie, cheat, steal, and deceive. You're clearly the winner. You're the better person. But the difference is you were never competing. Didn't even know there was a competition. But the whole time, it's a showdown. It's time to fight. wish fulfillment. That's what you get here because as I said, you're the star. One of your biggest flexes is going to be your success. One of your biggest flexes on these bitches is going to be your bank account, honey. One of your biggest flexes on these hoes is going to be all the property you own and the fame in which you've acquired due to the pain that was all over your back. better be open to receive because I'm telling you be open to receive this wish fulfillment she ain't gonna be able to stand it but it's coming and ain't nothing she can do epiphany breakthrough at the bottom she gonna have to read it and weep ho you know what she can do because you remember you woke up you had an awakening you went through all the stages of grief you went through all the hell you deserve it and she can't stand it feel like she's going to lose in a family situation here it's going to leave her very scarred because she's been manipulating possibly using children here but with present abundant and gratitude you've learned to live in the present you realize that i can't change nothing or fix or focus on nothing because yeah you the divine feminine but what is happening right now, I can't worry about yesterday, I can't worry about tomorrow, and I damn sure can't worry about next week. All I can worry about is right now, and that's what got you this far. You win this warfare. If you start feeling like you're not yourself, if you start getting depressed, like you're not motivated, like you don't want to work, like you just don't care, you need to cleanse because that's not your energy. You're in a spiritual warfare now. The same way you would go get your strap and shoot back, if you were in an actual war, you need to do the same in the spiritual realm. Do your research. Reach out to your spirit team. Do whatever you got to do. But, bitch, you need to fight back. Start by wrapping that head up. Shit just.